Our walk-ons have grown in terms of their, their responsibilities and their impact. Kevin and Tim ha have done an amazing job. They intellectually have to know everything the opponents do and that we do. And then physically, they got to be able to compete and bang around with these guys. It's a thankless job on the outside. On the inside, we respect the hell out of these guys. And Kevin and Tim are doing a great job for us this year. It's an interesting microcosm of our uh, program is the walk-ons and their own, almost their own private culture. It's kind of hard to understand unless you're a part of the, the close circle, but everyone has their role. And everyone's role is extremely valuable. They pass down through the years the expectations. They groom one another. They teach one another. So I just saw all the guys who came before me, Henry Lowe, Denny Grace, all those guys do it and how impactful it was. The lineage of Villanova walk-ons dates back years. The job requires not only dedication of time and effort, but a complete understanding of what the team is trying to accomplish to learn how to play Villanova basketball. Once you know it, you know it, and it's an awesome experience to help teach these young guys how we do things here. For our program, those guys are leaders and just important pieces to what we do. Having another responsible person who's 100% in with what we're trying to accomplish is very valuable. A constant effort to improve themselves and their teammates. And for the two walk-ons this season, the hard work is shared with each specializing in more than one aspect of day-to-day -day activities. I keep track of a lot of the stats during practice. Tim's more hands-on with the drills. We both know what each other are really best at, and we kind of just go from there. And nowadays in practice, we don't even need to communicate anything. We both just kind of know like that, and uh, we just get right into it. Every time you step between those lines, you play hard, harder than your opponent. On the court, it's vocally, and then off the court, you pull guys aside, you have conversations about our concepts, um, more in depth, making sure they understand what we do. That's really being a Villanova basketball player, playing hard every possession and taking pride in doing that. Their passion, their pride is that they're also like a coach. They know exactly how a coach wants the program to go. A walk-on in our program is, is really groomed to be a coach. Whether he wants to be or not, he's ready to be. In fact, for some, like Tim Saunders, the gateway to the program comes before they arrive at Villanova in an effort to continue a years-long basketball education. My high school coach coached here and helped me get here, so that's, that's my path right now. My plan is to pursue the coaching career. I would like to get into finance, I think, somewhere in New York City, but eventually I would really like to get into coaching and not really much of a better spot than to learn from Coach Wright. When he's playing me on the high side and that ball goes up top, I'm moving him up the lane. When he's playing behind me, I'm burying him to the baseline. First to a go-to, everybody got me? We gotta start getting solid in there. Footwork, 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 away. The walk-ons are all special, special uh, human beings, and they mean a lot to myself and, and, and the program. Tim Saunders, amazing job, Kevin Hohen, and all the walk-ons before you. In 20 years, they're gonna be the pillars of the community and uh, hopefully mentoring our guys. I just love being a part of this culture, love being part of the team. We've got a great group of guys, and it makes it that much more fun. I just wanted to be part of something bigger than myself and part of just a culture and a program that really values all the things that, that I believe in. When they graduate, they come back and check on each other and take care of each other. It's a great culture unto itself, the walk-on culture.